Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Monday Minute. Today is actually Tuesday. It is May 2nd. It's very good to be with all of you today. This week, uh, several of us will be attending the Board of Governors meeting in Fort Collins on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. We invite you to log in with a live stream link that is available through the system website. Um, if you would like to observe what happens at a Board of Governors meeting, and if your schedule permits, we encourage you to do that. I'd also like to congratulate Josh Koschke and the men's and women's golf team. They are the 2023 RMAC champions for the sport of golf. Congratulations to all involved. They will now advance to the national NCAA championship, and we wish them the very best as they advance in their sport. Finally, for today, I wanted to discuss briefly some transitions that are taking place in our business financial services unit. There is a memo that is attached to this email that will spell out more of the details. But at a high level, here's what's going on. Um, several months ago, we decided to combine the role of a chief financial officer and a controller into a single position, and Juanita Pena has been serving in that role. Juanita has asked to return to the role of a controller. Uh, when she returns back to the campus, that will be her position. Um, what I've done for the, the, the near term is to invite um, Meg Brewer, who has graciously accepted my invitation to serve as the executive in charge of business financial services. Um, and Meg's role will be in charge of business financial services. All things will report up through her, uh, but she will also be serving as the university's controller and the budget director um, while we make this transition. Um, that is effective immediately, and I want to thank Meg for her service. Um, I'd also like to introduce today, very excited about this new leader that's joining the senior leadership team of CSU Pueblo, and that is our county commissioner, Garrison Ortiz, effective on June 1, will be joining the leadership team as our chief financial officer. I'd like to thank Dr. Paul Polinski, who chaired the search, um, and congratulations to Garrison. We look forward to having you as a colleague. Um, and helping us with all things related to the finance and administration of our university. I'd also like to extend a special thanks to Juanita Pena for serving in that combined role for several months. Uh, that is the Monday Minute, or the Tuesday Minute, I should say. I wish all of you the very best for the week ahead. Thank you.